Hello friends, welcome back to my channel with another video on Mi Home security camera so how you can configure this mi home security if you have multiple camera how you can uh, configure this mi home security camera and then how you can remotely view worldwide and then how you can watch remotely in the pc or in the phone so all the steps you can learn in this video step by step so you have to watch video till end so you can learn easily how you can configure this all the cameras together and then watch remotely all the cameras together so before we continue if you are new in my channel please don't forget to subscribe my channel press the bell icon for the new update so let's begin to our topic so now our first step is uh, we have to download in our phone the app for this cameras to link the camera so we open the play store and then type in the search bar me home and then click ok now you can see this software we have to install in our phone so this is the first step in the phone if i off so now as you can see our application is uh, already downloaded so we just open and then click agree then again click agree now select the country you must select the uh, your country because if you select another country you cannot get access of this camera so you have to properly select your country which country you are currently living now or which country you are set up the camera so i am now currently in the pakistan so i select the pakistan there got error because it's updating now here is asking the sign in if you don't have any me home security account so you have to create a new id so what we need to do we just click sign in and then we just sign up here if you don't have uh, account we just click the create account so i'm showing in the full demonstration so i show you the step by step how you can create account all everything so you have to watch the step by step so this is our first step application and second step we are now creating our id on me home security now as you can see this one is the detail so we select our country first so I select the Pakistan and then select our email. You can give any email here. So I'm giving here the, my email. Now you set here the your password. So I just set my password here. <coughs> After set up your password, you click the terms and condition checkbox, click OK and then click next. And then if you want to save, just save and then click here. I am not a robot. Then you verify KJ traffic lights. So I just verify where I see the traffic lights. So I just verify by skill. Now enter the code. So I receive the code in my email. Then click submit. So as you can see now our me home security app is already open and we and we already signed up so our first and second step is done ready now we leave our phone and then connect any of this camera to charger normally this uh, me home security using the 5 volt charger uh, you get the any phone charger to give supply this camera so i just connect any uh, of one camera here i plug in then you can see the yellow light here automatically turning searching for the network then we have to add here in our phone so we have to factory reset so we enter here the password of this phone so as you can see our camera is now blinking blue light once it's blinking we just click here the plus icon just click add and then click the add device or you scan directly or manually controls or automation here is four options so i just click the a device and then click turn on bluetooth and then if you want to scan your camera with the barcode we just click the scan and then i just give the permission while using and then i turn my camera bottom you can see here the barcode it will detect automatically my camera model and then everything now it's asking the reset the device and then giving the instructions you have to press the uh, reset the our device so you find out here the button you see press that one reset successfully reset 
reset successfully once you listen that one you click the device reset and then now you can see the scanning for device so it's scanning for the searching this device so we have to wait for a few seconds now you can see here asking the Wi-Fi which Wi-Fi you want to connect the, uh, this camera so I select my Wi-Fi for example I select my Wi-Fi and then enter my Wi-Fi password here uh, this one is the your Wi-Fi password you want to link this camera so uh, you have to enter your Wi-Fi and then Wi-Fi password so I, I just add uh, my Wi-Fi password after entering your Wi-Fi password click OK and then click next You can see connected Wi-Fi successfully and then camera is connected already. So set a room. So you want to give the name for this camera. You give the create the room. For example, I just select here workshop and then click OK. So and then click next. Then click next. Then click next. Then do not share. I, I do not share. Do not prompt. then click agree now our camera is successfully preview our setup so if you want to watch just rotate and then you can simply rotate your camera you see it's working perfectly so you have to follow the same steps to add any other cameras so i just add firstly another cameras and then I'll show you the three cameras preview together so I just exit this one and then I add another device to continue. So I link another camera. So just I go back and then click the main menu then add device and then link my camera. This one is the second camera waiting for the booting. Wait for the booting. Once done boot, just click the scan and then scan the same, follow the same procedure, scan the barcode. If you don't want to scan, you just add manually, enter the model. If you don't have the QR code, here is option, the uh, no QR code available, add manually. So you can add also, you can simply add the manually. But I'm adding the QR code, my camera, just on the flash, so it will detect. Now asking the, reset the device, the same as instructions, so I just click that one. And then click here the then connect your Wi-Fi. Click next. Now the this one is showing the QR code, so you have to sh show like that to so scan. QR code is scanned successfully. Now it's connecting. Just click next. This one is the second procedure, the scan QR code from this phone. Now this device is already online. Set room. So I just create the room. For example, I select the study. Okay. Next. Then. Next. Then click next. Then click agree. Now it's working perfectly. You can see my phone here. This camera is working perfectly. So if I move the other side, here. So this second uh, camera also working perfectly. So two cameras already added. The, follow the same same procedure and then add the third one, a device, and then I link the third camera also. Same procedure. I just uh, this one I will uh, forward. So not wasting your time. So I just connect this camera also.
Connection to Wi-Fi completed. Preparing to account completed. Device online. Now, as you can see, this third camera also got preview. If I back, play, play, and then play. So here is the three camera preview, first, second, and third. So that is the all steps procedure that you can follow the steps and then you can add your cameras and watch the cameras worldwide. Now add the all cameras and then share the email and password to other user it will directly they will access this camera even they are using the mi home security amp app on desktop or mi home security app on uh, android so that is the whole procedure the how you can access the mi home security camera how you can get id all the cameras now you can see these three cameras all working here perfectly so hope this video is going to helpful for you if you like this video don't forget thumbs up please subscribe my channel press the bell icon for the new update so let's see you in the next video with the new tips new tricks thank you